Hey guys, welcome back. This is the Steve and the Alien tutorial series. For this particular video, we'll be focusing on the shot where the van basically misses the turn and starts to drive off the road. And this is going to be a very simple, straight to the point animation that you shouldn't have to spend too much time on. So to get started, please open up the document that you created where the road curves towards the horizon. And once you've done that, like always, make sure you go to File and Save As and name this a different file name than you have right now so that you don't mess up um, the existing file in case if you ever need to refer back to it. So now once you've done that, we need to import the van into the project. So we'll go to File, Import, Anime Studio Object, and we just need to locate that van prop, which is going to be the side shot of the van. And once you've done that, you click OK. And now you can see we have the van right here. So let's make sure that we bring the van above all the other layers on the timeline. And we can also increase the size of it, like so and then bring it over like that. So now we'll have a few seconds, probably up to a second actually of just still, and then we'll have the van drive past. So at 48 frames in or two seconds in, I'll just go and drag it like this. So then if we look at this, we can see that it drives. And that might be a little bit too fast, so I can just nudge the start frame back to about, let's try frame 18. And that looks a little bit better. And also we can adjust this frame so that it's a linear progression, just like that. And finally, we will do a slight camera pan. As you probably know by now, since you've watched this series, I like to do camera pans. So let's click on the track camera tool and starting at frame one, we can just nudge this over a tiny bit just to give us some leeway. And then we'll go all the way to frame 48 and just nudge the camera back like this. And then that's all you have is just a simple pan of the van going like that. And actually maybe I'll just nudge this van speed back a little bit. After I put it to linear, it seems to be going a little bit slower. That looks pretty good. Okay, and then we have a little bit of pan after the van exits the screen. So that works out. And that works. So, and that's all we really need to do. Once you have done that, make sure you save the file. And then go to File, Export, Animation and then you can export out the animation and view it and make sure you save that video file that you make as we will be using it later on in the series. And that about does it. See, I told you it was pretty simple compared to what we've been doing with the alien and all. I'm sure this was a nice break from all that extensive animation work. Anyway, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time.